today we have how to party like a snail. Do you like to party? Do you like a big party? Do you like a little party? Some people like big parties. Some people like little parties. Thumbs up if you're a big party person. All right. How about thumbs up if you're a little party person? That's me. I'm a little party person. How to party like a snail. Snail is a party animal. Yippee! Well, kind of. He especially loves the quiet things about parties, like confetti. Using his indoor voice to make new friends. Psst, hello. Did you hear something? Whispering meaningful wishes to cakes. I wished for more cake. And savoring those few silent seconds before everyone yells, Surprise! Three, two, hmm. But parties aren't often quiet. And sometimes things can get too loud for snail. That's when he shrinks into his shell. Shoop! That's a good onomatopoeia word. Shoop! So can you imagine him tucking himself back into his shell with that sound? From outside his shell, Snail still finds a way to join the fun. This is my jam. Bop, diddy, bop, bop. Too bad no one can see his sweet dance moves. Oh, I wonder if some of you have sweet dance moves. Sometimes Snail's friends try to coax him out. Come on out! Everyone's dancing. I'm partying in my heart. It sure doesn't look that way. It's just that things get a bit too loud for me sometimes. But loud is fun! It sure is, especially when it's less loud. Okay, well, enjoy your er quiet. They say silence is golden, right? I don't get it. And that makes him wonder if he's the only one who thinks that quiet is just as fun as loud. Merp. And I like that word right there, coax. Have you ever heard that word before? It says they try to coax him out. Thinking about what they're trying to do. They're trying to like get him to join the party, right? When you're coaxing, coaxing somebody, you're trying to like encourage them to do something. Lately, Snail hasn't been invited to too many parties. Uh, nothing in the mailbox. Nothing there. Instead, he spends a lot of time waiting. I hear that the mail can be awfully slow sometimes and waiting. Mm, look at that. The seasons are changing and he's still waiting and waiting until one day the, sm the smail carrier <laughs> finally arrives with a promising looking envelope for stump merp. Here Stump, this came to me by mistake. Not another one. Snail is starting to think that he's more of a party pooper than a party animal. It's not a party without Stump. <laughs> the only type of party he feels like going to now is his own pity party. And that gives Snail an idea. What if he threw his own party? It'll be the funnest, quietest party I've ever been to. First, he invites himself. Ooh, a party for me? I love me. Then he makes a pot of warm milk. Mmm, a hug and a mug. And lip syncs to all his favorite lullabies. Snail is having so much fun that things start to get wild. Let's make this party even quieter. Oh man, he's going to make his party wilder by getting quieter. To hype up the hush, Snail fluffs some pillows and rolls himself up in a blanket burrito. A soft shell. 
He's almost having the time of his life, but he can't help feeling like something is missing. I've got my shell, my milk, my blankets, my lilies. What could be missing? Is it too quiet? Could I miss the loud? Do I miss the loud? <gasps> Am I loud? And that's when Stump gently chimes in with a suggestion. Maybe your party is just missing a friend. Stump, you're shall come to my party. Well, I've always, I'm always here since I'm rooted in the ground, but your shindig is filled with my favorite things. Snail and Stump realize that they both love parties, just not the rowdy ones. Shall we shh together? Sure. <laughs> Gasp. <laughs> Look at that. He was, thought he had been way too loud there. In celebration of the shush, snail and stump play an exhilarating game of hide and hide. Ready or not, here we hide. Shoop. And here's that sound going back in his shell. Put on their favorite jammies. I feel like a marshmallow wrapped in a cloud. And then turn the lullabies way down. We can barely hear them. We're total party animals. Snail and stump party in their hearts all night long. And you are going to get a chance today to um, help Snail get ready for his party by decorating his shell and his party hat. And then uh, you can also learn how to draw your own snail. So hope you enjoyed How to Party Like a Snail. Do you party like a snail? Hmm. I'm looking at some of you. I'm thinking some of you know. <laughs>